G'day all, Tazdaz here and welcome to my latest video, thanks for stopping by. Today I'm doing a review of a item that's been requested by Starlight77, thanks for commenting and asking for me to do a review. So I'm doing today, Herbert Adams Artisan Range Butter Chicken. That sounds really good. That picture looks really good too. The one thing that isn't really good about these is the price. So they say they're a hand finished small batch, two pies from the freezer at the supermarket, $9.50 for the two pies. Thankfully I got mine on special, but that is pretty damn insane price. So they want to be good. So I've already opened up the box and I've got the pie out of the pack. So there it is. Obviously it's not cooked yet. Interesting little pattern across the top there. No aroma at all because it's still frozen. So what we're going to do is I'll um, put the ingredients, the nutritional information will all be up on the screen and the cooking time. It's going to take about 40 to 50 minutes in the oven. After spending $9.50, I've got to spend 50 minutes waiting for it to be cooked. Convenience, not. Anyway, we'll give it a go, see what they're like, give them a score for value and a score for taste out of 10. Okay, so I'm back. I've got my cooked butter chicken pie that's been in the oven. So it's quite nicely browned. Um, definitely just getting the, the aroma of the pastry at the moment. Um, pastry looks nice and flaky if you want to see it up close there. Doesn't look too bad, pretty evenly cooked. All right. So yeah, that's, that's sounding nice and flaky. Let's, um, Chop this in half and get the aroma. Well, it's very steamy. Yeah. I wouldn't really say it smells like butter chicken as such. Definitely smells like a curry chicken. Um, so there's the cross section of the pie there. So it looks like it's got nice pieces of real chicken in there. Uh, got your curry sauce. Um, there's the other cross section there. So again, you can see oh, over there, the pieces of chicken. It smells like it's got vegetables in it for some reason. Um, pastry is very flaky, it's going everywhere. So let's try a piece of the pastry first, see what that's like. Yeah, nice and buttery, pretty decent. Got a little bit of the um, the curry sauce as well. Definitely has a bit of a, a butter chicken flavor to it, which is, which is obviously good, because that's what it's supposed to be. All right, so let's dig in there and let's get some of this filling out. Like it's got, have a look at that, really nice big pieces of chicken there. So I can't complain about that. All right, let's give one, give, give a piece of the chicken a try. Hmm. Nice and tender, nice flavors, not bad, not bad. Pretty good so far. Um, now, no, I don't think there's any vegetables in here. Let's get a big amount of the, just the curry sauce there. Mm. It's quite nice. I would lean more to a curry chicken pie more than a butter chicken pie. 
So if you've tried something like Patax, 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 Sherwoods or whatever, there's a couple of different brands, butter chicken, definitely more a, a smoother, more buttery taste in them compared to this, which is more like a more traditional curry chicken that you'd be used to. All right, so let's get in there and have a bite of it all together. And one more. Mm. It's nice. It's got a nice curry flavor. It's a <coughs> excuse me. In that bite, it was a little bit buttery, so that was a, a nicer bite that time. But overall, yeah, it, it doesn't really sell me on being a buttered chicken pie. Um, so, rating time, so value, $9.50 for two pies, decent amount of chicken, nice-ish curry flavor. They're a bit expensive for what they are. For $9.50, you could go to a local bakery and probably get two proper handmade pies. So value, I'm gonna give them Five out of ten, definitely worth grabbing if they're on special. Um, and flavour, they're nice. They don't quite live up to being what I would call a buttered chicken flavour. So they'll get seven out of ten for flavour. Yeah. So they're not bad. They're definitely not great value at nine dollars fifty. Overall, a decent buy at but overpriced. So that'll be it for this review. If you liked the review, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe, hit that notification bell so you'll be uh, notified whenever I upload a new video, such as today's Herbert Adams Artisan Range Butter Chicken Pie. See ya.